the recognition, promotion, and remuneration of the waste pickers as a providers of the public service of recyclable waste collection in Bogota. Informal waste pickers in Colombia's capital have collected and recycled waste for more than 50 years. During much of that time, the waste management model in Bogota included privileged incorporated firms that control waste collection, transportation and disposal. From 90s to 2012, four companies held the oligopoly of waste collection in Bogota. In response to these situations, waste pickers, who had been organized since the, since the 80s, used various strategies, mobilizations, media awareness, campaigns, to secure their livelihoods. They also engaged in legal actions to demand their rights. This result in seven rulings and orders from the Constitutional Court of Colombia protecting the right of waste pickers. The combination of this constitutional pronouns has led to a new paradigm of waste management in Bogota and Colombia, one that is based on the recycling of materials as an alternative to disposal. More importantly, the recycling component is in the hands of the waste pickers, whose recognition has led to the provision of needed facilities and equipment for recycling, as well as a stable income, thus significantly improving their living conditions. In terms of the actions taken to comply with the recognition and inclusion of waste pickers that can be considered hits from the Bogota case and whose replications identifies a path to equality and inclusion of the waste pickers populations in the world, it is possible to state the following. The current administration has to develop a campaign of waste separation at the source, but more important, to deliver this waste, recyclable waste, to the waste pickers. Has replaced over 2,800 horse draw vehicles by trucks to those waste pickers who use the cart horses as a means to carry. Has paid with funds from the garbage collections fee more than 7,000 recyclers or waste pickers for their service of collection and transport of recyclable waste, significantly improving their living conditions. Such so actions are founded on the assertion that in any urban context where there are waste pickers in the streets or in landfills, their work is part of the public waste management. And if a local authority is promoting organizational schemes improving their con working conditions and remuneration for their service, then authorities help them to overcome poverty and vulnerability in a sustainable and progressive way, in addition to reintroduce responsibilities in every actor of the value change and every actor of the society.